What's up, YouTube? Okay, I'm going to be redeeming the shiny Poipole. This is for the TCG tie-in uh, store in Japan. I know a lot of you can't get this, but I wanted to give you a showcase to see what it looked like as well, so you guys can see. Plus, um, for any people, a uh, couple that do have Japanese uh, DSs and games out there, I've actually included some free codes throughout the video again at uh, certain points. I'm going to be uh, explaining this event and explaining some Poipole and Naganado movesets as well throughout this video. All right, let's get into it. I'm going to give you a bit of background information on this event too. So this poi pole comes at a thick nature, which is modest. Unfortunately, I would have loved it to be timid, but um, that's how it goes, I guess. Now, I'd, um, this one also is uh, only on Japan. So uh, at the moment, I'm not sure if it's going to come to the other regions, but um, hopefully it does. That would be good. Um, I'm just going to put the code in at the moment at the bottom of the screen. Sorry, I messed it up a couple of times. Um, anyway, so this is a Japanese only uh, event at the moment um, from a Japanese DS and a Japanese game. Um, this is just connecting to the uh, you know, mystery gift and obtaining it. Anyways, um, this runs from the start of March, which is March the 2nd, and um, it's going to April the 9th. Also, for all my patrons, just a quick little shout out, uh, you guys will all be receiving this event, and any new patrons that do sign up from here uh, onwards uh, will be receiving that event too. Plus, I'll be doing a giveaway of this one on my channel, like I did with the Shiny Kogue and Groudon, to, just to try and help the people out that uh, haven't got this. I know there's a lot, so I'll try and uh, give away on my next stream that I do as many as humanly possible, so I'm uh, trying for you guys. Anyway, uh, so this is the event. Uh, thank you for playing Pokemon. Pick it up from the Pokemon Center. Um, this one, I just played the Japanese game in English, that's why um, it's coming up this way. Now, um, as for tomorrow's upload, now I do have a, I was actually going to put a Pokemon sweep up tonight, but I have got that scheduled for tomorrow, so uh, that'll be up tomorrow. And on Sunday, I'll be doing a theme team, plus I'll be announcing my uh, PO box too, so we'll be doing that postman pimp thing finally, and that'll be pretty funny, and uh, I don't know. We'll see how that one goes. Um, if somebody, I'm guessing if I get some stuff sent to me, I'll open like a fair amount of it at, at once so I can have like a decent video uh, about it. So that should be pretty fun. Anyway, let's get into the uh, Poi Pole. So we've got uh, obviously a fixed modest nature, um, obviously fixed shiny as well. And we've got uh, in his cherish ball, obviously. Uh, we've got Venom Drench, Nasty Plot, Poison Jab, and Dragon Pole. So it comes with Dragon Pole so you can evolve it straight away, which is good. Um, the only, I guess, I guess the only thing I, I do want this to come to other regions. That would be cool. Um, hopefully it does. Um, I, I'm guessing it will. Um, I'd say normally it's a few months afterwards, but um, that's sort of how um, it rolls. So obviously it's got the uh, obviously it's got the classic ribbon on it as well, and met, met obviously at a lovely place, met at level 40. So there's all the legalities there. Oh, there's a little code for someone who's got a Japanese game and DS. But anyway, I want to go some Poi Pol movesets and some Naganado ones too. I've got some pretty interesting ones. So firstly, since we've, we're stuck with Modest Nature, right, I kind of thought a way around uh, it, because you kind of need your, you kind of need Timber Nature for speed, right? Because you've already got Nasty Pot to boost your special attack. So I was thinking like of a, a build of max speed, right? Um, you could put like about, you could put about uh, 68 EVs in special attack, and about 188 or so in health. That way you'd be able to get speed boost from beast boost, right? And But use Nasty Pot to boost up your uh, special attack. So I'm, I actually will uh, put that one up on the screen what I did on Showdown. But um, that could be a way to get around the uh, modest over timid nature, which sucks. But obviously if you already soft reset it for one or uh, whatever, or just have a normal one, you'd go with max uh, sp speed and max special attack. Um, tip in nature that would work and usually it would be like nasty pot dragon pulse or draco meteor uh, sludge wave fire blast um, the, the normal moves I'd see running on it and life or dragonium Z uh, I, I'd say they'd be the best moves to run on it very very strong Pokemon obviously poi pole's evolution right uh, so that but if you do want to try out that uh, if you do um, want to try out that set if this does get released down the track uh, or if you, or you've got a modest one yourself you can give it a go I, I was sort of just thinking how to get around that uh, little problem so um, I had poi pole I had a poi pole sweep myself I actually did one on my channel if you haven't seen it you should check it out I did like a bulky stalling one right so weird I'm just gonna give you what this set was because it's sort of like uh, I just want to make use of poi pole so it was a, uh, a venom I want to make use of venom drench right um, so it's got toxic uh, venom drench that's rest sleep talk. So it's just a pure stalling troll Pokemon, really. 
you could probably give it an attacking move if you had another Pokemon like put down Toxic Spikes for you or something like that. But I just ran that one as a max health, max defense, uh, calm nature. Or you could even split the defenses a little bit more with Everlight. So that was a fairly bulky one. Definitely a big gimmick set, but uh, I, I thought I'd... Um, I thought I'd talk about some uh, fun sets as well as some more like serious sets. But um, let's have a look at some of its other moves too. I want to have a look at what <laughs> physical moves it gets. So I did I actually did a physical Naganardel, and uh, actually let's 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 go for that one right now. So for the physical side, it's 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 just amazing, people. Oh, we've got Dragon Claw as a Dragon Stab. Now I had Gunk Shot on this one too. Yeah, I had Gunk Shot. Beautiful. Yep, yeah, Gunk Shot. Now I also, it actually gets acrobatics too, I'm, I'm absolutely amazing, uh, it gets facade, I'm just having a going over, it also gets outrage too, outrage is a, isn't that great though, um, being locked into it uh, is, is, is not good, it's also got poison jab if you want a 100% actually um, over gunk shots accuracy, but I'd probably go for gunk shot because it's attack is garbage, uh, obviously max speed, max uh, max speed, max special, uh, oh my god, not special attack, max attack, max speed, what am I talking about, and this, yeah, just, just go, uh, just go Adam and Asia, <laughs> so you need all the attack you can get, um, let's have a look at its other moves, it also gets amazing leech life, it's, uh, it's gonna be super handy, now, what else we got on here, we got, a shadow claw could be handy, um, it's also got, uh, X scissor, aerial ace, oh, you go for a fly MZ, people, that would be, just incredible. Uh, it's also got Iron Tail as well. It's a very shaky accuracy move. It's got a. Uh, it's also got Smart Strike. Um, it's got. Yeah, I gave it Throat Chop because I thought that was a really cool move. Like it's a movie you hardly ever see. So I think I gave my Throat Chop um, for the fun of it. Uh, and also, I think I gave it. Let's just give it acrobatics, <laughs> and we'll give it like. Um, I'll have to have like a consumable item for that. So maybe not. I could go to Z Acrobatics, that'd be, that'd be so good. Um, obviously, you could give it Dragonium Z or Poisium Z for the item as well. Let's just, let's give it Poisium Z this time, because this is such an amazingly strong set, right? Uh, so we'll get rid of Acrobatics, we don't want that. Um, we, we want something, we want something else. Something amazing. If we get, okay. Um, we could get Facade, if we get Burn, that could be a, that could be an option too. Actually, we'll just leave it at Leech Life because it's weak to Psychic type, right? So we'll give it Leech Life so it can hit Psychic type. Amazing set there, people. I'm just going to the last little four EVs on there. But, uh, yep, uh, amazing set. There's a physical Naganado. Kind of similar to my Naganado sweep I did. Um, probably almost exactly the same moveset or similar. Right. Um, let's have a look at a Poipol if you want to run one as like a, if you don't want to evolve it, if you just want to run like a special attacking one. It'd move pretty similar to the... Um, you know, the Naganado just evolved, just, just, just a little bit weaker. So you could go, obviously, Timber Nature would be nice because then you can boost your, you can boost your uh, speed with Beast Boost. That's the only thing with this event. Modest, obviously, dictates where Beast Boost, you know, goes. So um, that's a little bit of a problem. But uh, we could go for a, we could go for a, uh, a Choice Specs one. That'd just, that'd just be like super strong. Let's do a Choice Specs Poipol. The hype is real. So we could go uh, Dragon Pulse on it because that's, we all know that stab. And uh, we need a, we need Sludge Wave because that'd be cool. Now we're a little bit walled by steel at the moment. So uh, Hidden Power Ground would be amazing if you uh, want to, uh, if you want to invest the time in that. <laughs> um, you may get a fire type move. Though. I'm just going to look down at it. You may actually get fire, flamethrower or like fire blast. I'm just going to have a quick little, little look there. Um, don't want Hidden Power Fire. That would be very fun to get. Um, looking down for a special attack for fire type moves. Fire. Oh, well, um, no, there's, there's, there's nothing there. So you need hidden power fire or hidden power ground. So that's, let's just, I'll just put it on hidden power fire for now. Um, you can decide whatever you want to do with that, but, uh, hidden power and what other move can we give it? Signal Beam. Yes, let's give it Signal Beam. Got to hit those Psychic types. who have just got to do it. But uh, I think that's some pretty good sets. Some pretty fun sets. Obviously, uh, the last couple weren't very competitive, but they're more fun sets. So the Naganado, just the uh, you know the standard one, works very nicely. Um, I adjusted its EVs and stuff to, to suit Modest Nature. So you get the Beast Boost, Speed Boost, and then still use Nicely Pot and have a little bit of extra bulk. Not that it's probably the bulkiest Pokemon in the world, but uh, it's got a, a decent health stat, I guess. But... Um, 
Yeah, I, I thought that'd work around if you do have a modest one. If you've got a timid one, just go with max speed, max special attack, and timid nature. Uh, that would work really nicely too. But um, yep, I hope uh, you guys uh, enjoyed this video. At least if you didn't have the uh, a Japanese game, you got some Pokemon sets out of this and uh, had a good laugh at some of the amazing sets that I did. Tomorrow I'll be back. I've got a, I'm, I've got a, I know I've got a Pokemon Sweet to put up. I just got to edit it. Uh, if I don't do that, uh, we'll be back on Sunday for a theme team. And uh, Postman people will maybe be coming the week after that. So it should be pretty good. All right. Peace, people.